Hijacked Bangladeshi ship anchored 600 nautical miles east of Mogadishu, Somalia. Sailors are safe, says EU naval force. Pulses and chickpeas sold at higher prices in the market onion will be imported from India next week, says State Minister for Commerce. BNP have to wait for another election to change themselves, says Ubaidul Qadir. Opposition blame to divert public attention, alleges Rizvi. Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to my TV English News. I'm Ashikul Zaman with you in the newsroom today. You're watching the headlines. Now, the details. European Union Naval Force has confirmed the, past, the presence of 12 pirates on the hijacked Bangladeshi ship MP Abdullah in the Indian Ocean. Operation Atlanta is keeping an eye on the Bangladeshi commercial ship. The vessel's current position is approximately 600 nautical miles east of Mogadishu, Somalia, according to the notification published on its website. The situation on board is that pirates have seized and taken its 23-member crew hostage, the statement said. The crew is safe and action is still ongoing, the statement said. EU Navy finds three possible pirates' bases of Somali coast. Robbery is being conducted from these bases. Operation Atlanta is in close contact with Bangladeshi and Somali authorities in this incident. Earlier on March 4, carrying coal from Mozambique's Mapetu Port, Bangladesh's ship MV Abdullah started its journey from the United Arab Emirates. Later, the ship was hijacked by pirates around 1.30 p.m. on Tuesday. Ahead of Ramadan, all types of pulses and chickpeas are being sold at increased prices. The price of chicken and sugar is also on the rise. Soybean oil is being sold at fixed price. The prices of everyday products are also the same as before. However, the prices of all types of rice and spices have increased. Vegetable prices are stable. The price of rice has increased by taka 150 to taka 200 per sack. Traders say that the price of rice is high due to the manipulation of mills owners. Customers are in dire state in Ramadan. Also, the prices of ginger, garlic and spices have increased. Market control is never possible without the cooperation of those who manage and control the market, says State Minister for Commerce. Hassanul Islam Chichu. He said that the first shipment of onions imported from India will arrive next week. Dhaka North Mayor Atikul Islam said that the price list will be kept in the market of the capital for purchase. They said these in separate events in the capital today. It is being investigated whether the syndicate is being formed from anti-government sentiment, says Awami League General Secretary Ubaidul Qadir. In a, in a briefing at Dhanmundi in the afternoon, he said that if BNP wants to change the government, it would have to wait for another election. Ubaidul Qadir also commented that BNP has lost its movement capacity. BNP Senior Joint Secretary General Ruhul Kaviris B. Hamid has claimed that the government is blaming the opposition party for diverting the public's attention to other sectors without being able to control the market situation. He made this claim at a press conference at the party's central office in Noyapolton today. Rizvi said that the government has undertaken the project to destroy the BNP by endangering the people of the country. International Crimes Tribunal Public Prosecutor Advocate Golam Arif Tipu passed away at City Hospital today. He was 93. He breathed his last around 8 a.m. today while undergoing treatment in the capital's Lab 8 hospital. Advocate Golam Arif Tipu died due to old age complements. Complications. Advocate Golam Arif Tipu, born in Kamula Kantapur village of Shibgons Upojala of Chapainabab Gons on August 28, 
1931. His father, Abdabuddin Ahmed, was a district registrar. We're about to the end the headlines once again. Hijacked Bangladeshi ship anchored 600 nautical miles east of Mogadishu, Somalia. Sailors are safe, says EU naval force. Pulses and chickpeas sold at higher prices in market. Onion will be imported from India next week, says State Minister for Commerce. BNP have to wait for another election to change themselves, says Ubaidul Qadir. Opposition blamed to divert public attention alleges risk. At least 29 Palestinians killed and more than 150 injured as Israeli forces attacks eight collectors in Gaza City. Liverpool sail into Europa League quarterfinals. Leverkusen win with stoppage time goals. That's all for now. To watch our news online, please visit YouTube slash MyTV News. To watch our old programs, please visit YouTube slash MyTV Bangla. Our next news bulletin will be telecast at 7.30 p.m. in Bangla. Stay tuned. Allah Hafiz.